Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Eric Oren. Happy Monday, everybody. Uh, we are here at the beginning of our week, and if you're headed to school this morning, here is your bus stop forecast for the day. It's going to be a nice dry one, and we should be in the 50-degree range this morning, so a little bit warmer morning than we've had over the past couple of days. No precipitation in the forecast today, but because it's still in the 50s and we're getting closer to that temperature change, I would not be surprised if, again, your parents make you bring a little sweatshirt, maybe a little jacket with you. Don't fight them. Just do it. You can take it off when you get to recess. They won't even know about it. Now, we take Take a look at Mount Bachelor. Pretty beautiful day here as we have some color in the sky and some visibility as well. There is a chance we'll see some smoke in the area a little bit later this afternoon, but wind set to pick up shortly after that and scour it out of the area. So hopefully we'll continue to have some nice visibility here in the area uh, as we take a look forward at our weather headlines for the day. Now we do have some very warm days ahead. Uh, we're going to be in the 80 degree range this week. In those dry conditions we've been having will persist. We're still listed in the severe drought category as of the last drought monitor. But our air quality is pretty good in the area today. Like I said to you, there is a chance we'll see a little bit of smoke later today, but it shouldn't change our smoke forecast all that much. Now, let's take a look around the Pacific Northwest here. There's a little bit of pressure activity moving its way across Washington here. It's bringing some cloud cover into our area, maybe keeping the northwestern part of the state just a hair cooler, a couple degrees, and it can increase some wind speeds just a little bit to the north of us. And let's take a look at where that cloud cover may end up over the next couple of days. Now, by tonight, for the most part, smoke and uh, sorry, uh, cloud cover going to gather uh, just west of the Cascades here and stay pretty much out of our area. And on Tuesday, there's a chance we'll see some more cloud cover and some scattered showers to the southeast of us. But for the most part, as I mentioned to you, we're going to be staying dry over the foreseeable future. And here's a look at the windiest part of our afternoon and evening. It's going to be around 5 o'clock. may pick up just a little bit to the north of us later than that, but it's going to die down by around midnight. And by around 5 o'clock, as I mentioned, the wind is moving to the south and southeast. 10 to 20 mile an hour range and getting nice and variable again after midnight tonight. Now the smoke forecast is going to reflect that as well. You can see a little bit of smoke concentration making its way into central Oregon by around 3 o'clock this afternoon. But winds picking up here and moving all that smoke just out of our area. So shouldn't affect our smoke or air quality forecast too much over the very short period here ahead. Now as of right now, we are in the moderate to good air quality range. Uh, sisters Bend and Red in the moderate range and there's a chance that the areas to our north Madison Warm Springs will slide into the moderate range as well but as of right now the forecast is looking pretty good. Our across the state today we're in the 40s and 50s right now some 60 degree temperatures to our north but it's going to be a pretty close to average seasonal day and we're going to be in the 70s and 80s except for a little bit of cooler coastal temperatures there. Now in our area we are going to top out or right now pardon me we're in the 40s and 50s a little bit cooler down there in Lapine but we're going to top out today close to 80 degrees a little bit warmer in some places 84 degrees out of Redmond 86 they're pretty warm out of warm springs let's take a look at that seven day forecast headed our way our smiley today pretty happy how could you not be we do have some warm dry conditions headed your way as we round the corner through the midweek you can see things warming up going into the weekend with some above average temperatures that's been just a quick look at your local alert weather